What's up guys, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add Android permissions into your Android Studio. So if you have installed new version of Android Studio then you will find out that in your Android manifest.xml file you will be getting only one uh, permission at the bottom. So here you can see. Uh, why? Because other permissions has been removed which were default earlier. So let me show you how you can quickly add all those permissions which are required for your application because I was also facing the problem later on I added those permissions and then after my uh, apps started working. So uh, currently you are on uh, my Android Studio and here we have Android Manifest.xml but you have to move ahead with this uh, URL which is uh, developer.android.com forward slash reference forward slash android forward slash manifest dot permission so once you are over here then you will be getting list of all the permissions on the right hand side and each of the constant has the definition on the left hand side so here is the uh, description of all the permissions which are uh, over here so mainly we have needed only uh, internet permissions then uh, we need to for example we are interested to upload our uh, write something into your uh, Android device then we needed external and internal storage uh, permission and maybe camera so let's add uh, one after the other so here on the right hand side you can see that if uh, for example we are interested to add the permission of camera then we need to add this camera so uh, if you are clicking on this camera then you will be getting all the uh, details related to camera permission so they have given the uh, way that this is the way to add into your manifest, uh, manifest file. So let me uh, copy this specific line from here and then paste it down below and here you need to add camera. So this is the camera and I have added that. Alright, so in the same way internal and external storage, so I am going to copy both these lines and then uh, for example I am interested to read um, external storage, so here we have so this is a read external storage so on the right hand side you need to mention read external storage so in the same way we have write external storage so this is write external storage yes now we are done you need to save these changes and uh, for example you are interested to uh, create the build here we have the build and then we are clicking on build apk so now the app which will be exported from here and generated as an uh, APK here you can see that we have uh, APK if you are clicking on locate then app-debug.apk now you can install this app into your uh, Android, to, uh, Android device alright so then after you will not be facing any uh, issue and meanwhile let me show you one more thing so actually uh, when you are adding such permissions for example uh, your user is using uh, your Android device for the first time so then he will be getting a pop-up and over there he will have to allow or deny the uh, permission if he is allowing for example uh, we are uh, we are seeking the permission for uh, ca camera usage so at that moment if he is uh, clicking on allow button so that means we can take the pictures alright so this is the way to deal with all the permissions so make sure that if you are thinking any uh, you have any problem with the uh, any error or something like that you can add uh, your question below in the comment section i will be happy to uh, help you out in that so thank you so much for watching this video so if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel and also like this video so see you in the next video